What's up guys, it's Carlos from Your House Fitness and today we're gonna to be talking about the average bench press. So whether you're an avid gym goer or new to lifting, understanding what constitutes as an average bench press can help you when setting realistic goals and when tracking progress. In this video, we're gonna go over the concept of the average bench press, as well as some tips and tricks you can do to improve your bench. Now, before we dive into what is the average bench press, let's quickly go over some basics of the bench press. The bench press is a classic upper body exercise that primarily targets the chest, shoulders, and triceps. It is a staple in many strength routines and in the sport of powerlifting. The amount of weight you can push on a bench press is commonly used to determine upper body strength. So what exactly is the average bench press? Well, it's important to understand that what is considered average can depend on many different factors. Factors including your age, gender, weight, and training experience. All these factors play a role into what is your bench press number, so it's kind of tough to give you an exact number. However, we can give you some rough estimated numbers when talking to trainers and others in the fitness industry. So for an adult male who is relatively new to the gym, their average bench press might fall between 135 or a plate and 185, a plate and a 25. And for an average female in that same category, they may be lifting anywhere between 65 pounds and 95 pounds. And of course, these numbers may vary and the more experience you have, the higher the numbers will be. So although we're talking about averages, it is important for you not to base your performance on other people and instead look for ways that you can improve your bench in your own fitness journey. And if you find yourself on the lower end of these numbers, it can be used as motivation. So if you're looking to improve your bench press, here are a few tips. Number one, staying consistent. The more you bench and the more you practice, the better you'll be at it. So as you get stronger and as your form gets better and better, you'll see your numbers rising up. So stick with it, consistency is key. Number two, work on that form. The only way you can improve is with proper form. We don't wanna see our numbers increasing because our form is breaking down. This might be your butt lifting off the bench, the bar being uneven, or not getting the full range of motion. This can lead to injuries, which will make it really, really hard to see progress. So make sure your form is right, and if you have questions about your form, we have a few articles and videos that you can check out on the bench press form. And number three, you will need progressive overload. So this means gradually progressing the weights, little by little, to challenge the muscles and to stimulate growth. Progressive overload is key, but don't sacrifice form for weight. And number four, make sure you take your rest. So this means making sure you have proper sleep, nutrition, and taking rest days if needed. So I hope that answered some questions. I know we didn't give you a straight answer on what is the average bench press, but I hope you can see that it doesn't really matter what the average is. As long as you're focusing on your own bench and your own progress and doing the right things, you will see results. Try not to get caught up in what other people are doing and focus on being the better version of yourself. So if you guys did learn something, leave a like in the video and subscribe. I'm Carlos from Your House Fitness and I'll see you guys in that next video. Peace.